Hello Diamonds and welcome back to Raptor X Equus Republic server. So since last time I have finally finished building this platform so there's no hole anymore and uh, also I have bought few new vehicles we finally have this ski stairs so mining is a lot easier and I have mine a lot of coal and a lot of other things and I also bought myself the new truck because I'm helping out with the roads and, and the currently thing is that the manufacturing is a little bit too slow and even now I have to go and mine a bit more of the rocks so let me put all the stuff from here into my storage and then let's go downstairs and do some mining. Yeah, I have my other truck right here as a backup if I need to use that. This one is much quicker, but a lot bigger, so easy to get started. Yeah, all my machines are just running full time. The brushing has finished. I did some of the mining a few hours ago. I can concentrate the export of the time. So I have also expanded my mine a lot. Now I have like small area to go through. And uh, straight ahead is the old mine. Right here is my Speedster, which I can use to take all the blockouts because they need to focus apparently mainly on the rock sides. I think I will probably go on the far side and start just taking the sandstone arts. It's the quickest way to get as the approach done. The capacity of this is also affected. Bring the truck over. But yeah, definitely the mining is like a lot quicker this one. Before it was like I could barely like finish one load and it was already like finished the processing part, but but now it's possible to actually have the large lumber stockpile full of all the rocks whilst this process. So I'm actually, I put up some bio-oil for better machinery, the jaw brushes. So hopefully I can get those and then speed up the brushing by 10 times. Okay, we'll see how it goes. And I also don't need to use my energy to make anything. So I'll be using for the crushing and concentrate making for this. One downside with this, this, those machines is that what I found, especially on this server, not sure if it's because it's or some changes in the game mechanic. Probably the game mechanic itself, as it was mentioned in one of the posts. That whenever I get out of the vehicle and it's too close to the edge, I end up on top of everything, which is a little bit disturbing and makes it more difficult to get everything done. It has been quite a lot of fun. Yeah, just taking quickly through the rock. So far, so good. Some delay spikes sometimes occur.
Then now we are focusing a lot on the roads, which is good. Maintenium is also providing some roads for other players, happily. We do the, there still is discussion about the monopoly situation. It happened last week. We need more players making them than just two or so at least I can see only like one player making it so far. Okay, Insanium is also providing them much better. So at least for the time when I usually get online, there's like almost no asset roads usually available and I cannot do any road building. So just before I started recording, there was discussion on Discord, like, like it seems that no one in the south, which is the area where I am, is like doing any road building. And the reason is just because there's no roads to do. But at the moment I can see the taxis doing the roads, which is very nice. So I think he also has to buy order after those roads, so, so Insanium can easily sell to him directly. I need for the extra stores. So yeah, I put some buy orders up myself as, as well, so I can take in like a thousand pieces. It's not much, but should help. So this is what I've been doing all the weekend really. It's just too much demand for all the rocks and so usually I, I leave the machines running for whilst I'm offline and by the time I get back in then there's like nothing left. At the moment it's also getting quite full. So the concentrate making is a little bit slow. Prepare the machines for that. So, not yet. So, I probably would need to get the sensor based belt sorter as well. How much it might cost? It's a lot of stuff inside. Might be a bit too expensive to make at the moment. As long as I have brush rock, it should be fine. This one can run overnight, not because salads. We have sweet salads. Okay, I should put my rocks up. <coughs> sweet salads. I think usually when I make some bad food, I put it for sale, so maybe I don't have. And yeah, I just sold a lot of stuff. So it seems that Insanium sold me 800 rows and took a lot of my resources that I had. Excellent. So now we can go and do some road building then. Let me go upstairs, get my sweet salad and get to work. There's a lot of growth today. And yeah, during the weekend I also made new storage space. So the old growth that went down, I had to move it away. The storage was too limited. Now I'm even thinking 
making the road a bit wider on this side where the river is. Uh, to use some brakes. It's too narrow and I always get stuck and come downstairs. This time I was lucky. So I have to get out of the truck and retry. So let's see. Setting income selling sweet salads. Oh, nice. Let's go to the kitchen and see from here if I can find sweet so here is now low. Okay, I will need to increase the okay. quite easy. Let's take the doors off. Interestingly enough, <laughs> it helps. Okay, storage. The kitchen one, I don't ask it. Yeah, then I don't have. I have, to, I have to probably order it from the north. So, yeah, no one is making it for us. Yeah, it's not available on the market. <coughs> it's a little bit sad. Let's put in the high order for those. Salads. Oh, let's see how many. Ten. And that's probably eight coins each. That's quite expensive, but I really want them. Last guy here, yeah, let's eat at least something. Find some food to get. Pretty much perfect. Yep. That is the only one that is a bit higher, but very balanced. That's good. Let's take our roads. Other truck as well. This way I can easily just change the truck and go. And let's put two of those placed as well. I'm thinking that, that I need some storage space for other things. I also have to take off like the old parts of the road that I'm replacing on the map. I mean, before I started recording, I was doing this road here. I think I will continue that. And I will use some of the dirt around the area to fill up the gaps that someone else has left under the road. Go here and park the back of the nose. Get this side so no one can drive it there. And this back. Very slow, suddenly. Some 
cuts. Yes. I love all the road and uh, all the road stats are present. It looks nice and solid underneath. line yeah, unfortunately the edge line of the of the ramp is not solid like everything else it's easier to just leave it blank the other side I have to make one more What's that? That was very strange. So I was thinking that we can make it flat instead. Perfect. Probably it's even better idea, yeah. Uh, I will probably clean it up. Make it flat then. So in this case, I think I will go and take my, my trusty Skid stands. Let's get it done. Okay. I'll be back in a sec. So here they are. Is the ski step. Let's take all this that out of here. It's so easy. This way. So for the first, I have to put ramps in so I can go down. By one layer. So, let's do so. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Okay. Okay. This, this. Yeah, 
storage space over here. I have one left. This yes. I want to get the box and stuff actually. My base. Deeper, it seems. The drive, the storage. Wonderful. So much monster and strange space. Yeah. You know, this case that the building grows or flattened and painted, it would be very troublesome. Oh, what was that? <laughs> Sometimes when you dig the rock and it goes so strange. down in, in the mine my vehicle is usually jumping around the lots. It's a good source of limestone. A lot of limestone. Yeah, I think that's where I will leave it for the video. I will continue making the intersection and well, I will get back to you in a few days. Take care.